Yeah, yeah. So I mean, of course, I, the the first thing that I always think is that I hope that people are finding talks every day that interest them. You know, I mean, that's 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 one of the mo most important things. And of course, it's a tricky thing because we run a we run a, a mainly a bottom up type science program where we rely on the community to propose sessions. And we hope that in those proposals that it kind of covers all the interests that, that, that people have and that as a result of that they find something that they, that they, they, they enjoy and that they can listen to and learn from. But there's always a worry, I should put it, that, that, that there's gaps, that there could be a gap, you know. And of course it's a tricky thing because when people come to um, submit an abstract to the meeting, they look at the program and if they see a gap, you know, they, they might not submit their abstract, you know, and, and it's difficult to get feedback from those people because, of course, they're not coming, <laughs> you know, they didn't find what they wanted. So what I really then hope is that those people will then think about submitting a session next year in the Montreal meeting, for example, that, that could then fill that gap. However, when I look at the meeting, I'm, I'm, so far I'm pretty happy. I think it, it, does, it does cover those, uh, most of those areas. There's, a, of course, in addition to finding something that's interesting, what you really hope is that researchers are getting that, that key bit of feedback from their talks or their presentations. You know, it's really, it's really important that the scientific method is such that you know, the results and ideas and hypotheses are discussed again and again and again. And the importance there is that there are other researchers with different perspectives that are maybe looking at the same problem but from a different angle. And the amount of feedback and, 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 and information that they can then give can be radical to a, to a project. And it's at a meeting like this that that type of interaction is happening. You know? we, we often say to the students that you, know, you can save a lot of time in the laboratory if you read some papers. But that amount of time pales into insignificance into the amount of time you can save by talking to a, an experienced researcher here who has just seen your talk and has a different angle and is working at it from, from a different perspective. <laughs>